Good evenings, my minions, and welcome back to Attack of the B-Team Mod Pack with yours truly, Dr. Professor Dumble Frankosaurus Jr. I skipped a beat, didn't I? Ow. Ow. It's the old trick knee. My bad. Uh, let's try that again. To stop laughing at my knee, it's uh, an old wound. I took an arrow there once. Anyway, Dr. Professor Dumble Frankosaurus Jr. Yeah, that's the one. Anyway, <clears throat> so I apologize for the uh, lack of B-Team content, Attack of the B-Team content, that is, and... Uh, it is because this is the end of the summer here, and it's very hectic. We're trying to get in on the last minute. Uh, vacations with the family at home. Um, so my playtime has been cut significantly. However. How... Can you get the vacuum? I go, oh, never mind, it's gone. Uh, however. We have some plans for today. I have a really important mission. We have an important mission today. And why don't we take a look at the docket? We have one thing to do before we get started on that. So, bam! Mad Science today. My head case. Right. I got my head back from Chim, right? It's right here. There it is. So, that was what started the whole alliance thing between Chimney and I. Um, so, we're going to put that in a case today and stick it on the wall. And here's the big deal. Here's what we're going to do today. This is going to be, again, very fun, but also a, a mission of great import. Check it out. We're going to share up Flim Flam Street with a dunk tank. That's right. The poor citizens of Flim Flam Street have been oppressed for, for some time now. They're hiding in their homes. They're afraid to step out into the streets because of all the armed criminals out there. That uh, Gli uh, not Gliss, um, Corrales and Schism have populated the streets with, of course. So there's war, there's strife, there's counterfeiting, there's criminal activity, there's gun smuggling, right? So nobody wants to leave their homes. They're afraid. They're depressed, they're oppressed, and we are going to cheer them up today with... Bam! Oh, jeez! Bam! <laughs> Page 7. A dunk tank. Yes, sir. And ma'am. And kids. And whoever. So this is what we're going to do. I have some things to gather before we get started. So let me go off and do that stuff. And I have a plan. I've already built this in, in single player mode. Because uh, we want to get it done. And we want to get it done right. And I don't want to derp around too much. We just have to collect the materials. So, but first things first. We have to put some things away here, don't we? Let's put, ooh, we got the bat killer. We got the head. Look at the size of that gun, huh? Uh, don't be envious, Hyco. <laughs> it uh, doesn't really work very well. Um, and it's dangerous. Oh! Hi. Somebody left the door open. How about we put the head... I have got this lovely case. This is a uh, birchwood case. Uh, you know what? Let's get rid of the soul here. Ghastly soul. Indeed. I don't want the red. Because red is anger. Right? Brr. Slipper's nose. Red is a symbol of anger. Makes people mad when they look at red. Let's put our soul over... Oh, boy. I'm just running out of space. Can I put that next to this one? I can. And open up. Plop. Close. Close, close, close. Thank you. And now for the head case. Dr. Professor Dumble Frankosaurus Jr., the head case. Ha ha ha! Hey, that's not even me. That's Steve! <gasps> I've been tricked. We've been bamboozled by Chim the Witch. Just kidding. Um, you can't really get your head, I don't think. So, ooh, stalactite. T for top, stalagmite, M for bottom. Too much coffee. Yes, slippers, too much coffee. <laughs> Let's gather the supplies, shall we? We need stuff. Dun, 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 dun. Lapis, blue glass. And we're going to make a bit. I, I looked at a, um, I went on Google and I did a search for dunk tank. Hit images. And they all looked almost exactly alike. So this is going to be really easy. Um, I need all the lapis I can get my hands on. We're going to make the exterior of a blue lapis variety. And we'll take a little redstone. We might need a little bit of that. There is actually this cool thing from Open Blocks called the Target. And it's easy to make. Sticks and wool. Ooh. I thought I had one of these made up, but perhaps I do not. Let's just use the orange wool, because I need to save the white for something. And let's just make up this little fella right here. 
And what was it? Just do zap, boom, and chaka chaka. Chaka chaka. Little, uh, that's a little foreshadow, by the way. Uh, sort of. Target. So that's, that's the target. Isn't that awesome? The trick to this is you put it on the ground and it lays down flat. You have to provide a power for it. Do I have any stone? You have to provide power. Some some power source, right? Um, and then it flips up and then you shoot it with a bow. Hold on, cat. Oh, I missed. So you go like 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 that. Ching. And then you shoot at it. I don't want to shoot it with this bow because these arrows are amazing and I don't want to bust them up. So we're going to make a regular bow, okay? With regular arrows. We'll keep that there at the dunk tank. You know what a dunk tank is, I hope, right? <laughs> Look it up. Oh, dear. Can I get that back? Yeah, it's like a tank of water. You get them at circuses and fairs. And someone climbs up. They sit on a little, uh, like a little chair that's rigged up to a target. You shoot and throw stuff at the target. And if you hit it, the dude in the, in the, on the seat falls into the water. And everybody goes, yay. It's funny. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to go cheer up the people of Flim Flam Street. They deserve it. Um, I do need some yellow... And you'll see why. But here's what I want to get. I want to get this yellow. Now, in my testing, I tried this out, and this yellow just wasn't bright enough. So if you look at those banners, the targety thingies, uh, they're really super bright yellow. So I tried the, this wool, and it didn't really work out too well. So what we're going to do is let me show you this yellow. So I looked up yellow, right? And I found this giant yellow flower from Biomes of Plenty. You can't make it. You gotta go out and find it. Ooh, what's that? Um, you gotta go out and find it. So, guess what? I remember flying over to Chimney's place. Over here. See the trail? Wee! And that's when we did the prank on Chim. This right here is a garden biome. Those are trees. Or giant flowers, rather. Made of um, that material. That bright yellow and bright red flower material. And I want to use that for the banner. So that's where we're going to go. Okay. So let me let me just finish up gathering the regular mundane items here, and then we'll go see if we can get that. I want to get bananas too, but I haven't I haven't found them yet. That's part of the food thingy, Majigger. Food mod here it is, but there's apparently banana trees out in the world. I've never found one, but I want to get bananas for something. Bingo! There they are. Lovely thing. Oh my gosh, and they have pink chickens. Or red chickens. What are you, fella? You're a ro rosester. Like a rooster, but a, a rosester. A rosester. Whatever. Hi. Mind if I... Yeah. Um, nice meeting you, too. Mind if I take some of your trees? Hmm? The yellow ones. You can keep the red. Okay, thanks. Now, do I need anything special for these? I don't believe I've ever gotten this stuff before. That seems to work pretty well. I would imagine. Whoa. It's just a chicken. Okay. Axe. Oh, oh no. Axe destroys. Bad. Axe bad. Shears good. And I'm going to need a whole bunch of these. So let me snag some of this. Oh, look at this middle piece, too. It's like the stem. Giant flower stem. It is indeed. I know words. I good with vocabulary. Hmm. All right, well, that's 58. That's more than enough. I just got kind of carried away here, chopping down the yellow flower trees. Now I feel badly. I don't want to be too greedy. I don't need that much. It makes a funny sound, Mommy. All right, my minions. We're on Flim Flam Street now. Just looking for a suitable location for our dunk tank. And it doesn't look like we have much space to work with. Not only do we need an appropriate amount of area for the actual dunk tank, but we need to be able to step back and shoot at the target, right? So we need to go at least, I don't know, 20, 25 paces away from the darn thing. And look at this, wow. Isn't that beautiful? This is new. It's not complete yet, but dang it. Look at the detail work, woo. This has either Corallus or B-double-O written all over it. I love it. Loving it. Good work there. Even for criminals. But yeah, this is a sign of the times right here, right? Look at all the soldiers here with guns. We've got headstones of dead soldiers. 
right in the town. There's no one walking the streets. Everybody is all holed up inside their homes, fearful to come outside. So this is why we're doing this. This is a good deed right here. And I think I found a spot right here. I kind of measured it out a little bit earlier, but it's going to be tight. It's going to be a little bit tight, but I think we can squeeze it in there. We need 10, about 10 or 11 Y. Let me see. Uh, I did this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, two, and... All right, my minions, I have returned, and the excavating is done. I'm not really a fan of the square and straight edges here to fit this thing in, but there's really nowhere else to put it. And I'm also thinking we might be able to just remove the rest of this hill altogether anyway, because we might get other people building in here and this could be a nice little corner location a lot of heavy traffic well actually no traffic anymore because nobody's out of their houses all right yeah let's let's cheer them up let's do it let's win the hearts and minds of the citizens here of flim flam street by providing them with some giggles and laughs and a little bit of a uh, little bit of entertainment and fun time so here's what we're gonna do i'm actually you know what no 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 i need you back so this is the tank frame so again check out the uh just get onto google and type in dunk tank and look at the images and you're gonna see it's basically just a just a small little tank a little bin and i'm gonna do it by five by i think one two um we want the tank part to be two by three that's good so is that gonna be right yeah five by four I'm gonna fill this in though. And then we're just gonna go right on up. And I think we're gonna go up about, let's see, one, two, three, four. I want the window to be right here and about two blocks high. So I might have actually gone up one too many. Let me just step back and take a look. Oh, that's perfect, okay. That way we're not too close to the edge and we wanna put a stair over here to get up into the back. So the folks that are brave enough to get dunked can uh, can climb up and get up in the seat in the hot seat or well, the wet seat i guess depending on how you look at it so i think that's about right um is it yeah yeah that's right okay so let's put in the windows of the glass rather which is going to be one two three four five six it's going to give us a lovely window inside so that one the the victim gets dunked we get to see it in all its glory. Ooh, geez. And I am not going to have enough lapis. I still need to make some slabs and some stairs. And, oh gosh. Didn't see this coming. Did not see this coming. Um, shoot. Oh, pfft, dummy. I might have to take a quick trip and get some more lapis. But it's real easy. Yeah, that is not going to cut it. Uh, I need a lot more. Yep, but that's okay. You know what? I'll do that in a minute. I don't need it at the moment. And I'm fact. I'm um, um, fact. I'm um, fact. I'm done with the glass. And now what we want to do is get on to the yellow flower. The giant yellow flower. And I'm going to need my saw for this. Because we are going to cut these down into panel size. And... Ah, 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 ah. This Gliss over here, he's got some kind of a power company. You just get close to this stair here and it all opens up and freaks you out. So hopefully that doesn't get in the way of, the, of our uh, dunk tank. We're going to stand back here and shoot at the target anyway. So shouldn't activate that, hopefully. All right, let's cut this down to size. And we've got slabs first. Not sure how much we're going to need. And then we have panels. And I'm assuming 10 is going to be enough because we get two per. And let's make about 12. I didn't really do any math. Again, we just we just wing it around here. You know how it works. Uh, let's see. Should we put it... We want to put it on the... I'm trying to remember how I had it on mine. Um, on my single player. I think I had it... I guess it doesn't really matter, but the, the important thing is you want it on this edge of a block. Let me think about this. If we're going to have the target, it's going to be here. 
Uh, we can have it up front. Yeah, let's put it here. This is fine. Let's put it right here. We're going to put one, two, and three like that. Let me step back and make sure that's visible. This is the banner that's going to have the target in the center. So it's kind of like a backstop. So if you miss the target, the arrow is going to stick into the banner. And I'm still seeing flying fish around here. Okay. This will work fine. It's not the same way I did it in my single player. I did have it forward one, but that's because I was fooling around with pistons. I had a pistons in the side here that would uh, pull the floor out from underneath someone instead of using a trapdoor, which is what we're going to do in this particular design. So it's a little bit different from what I had before, and uh, we're going to put it right here in the very center. Again, the important thing is, if you're going to build this, you have to make sure to see how it, this, this cover uh, is not on this block, it's on this one because we're going to attach some blocks on the back here. And that is how you do that. So we're going to go up one extra up above the actual tank portion, and it looks like I'm going to need more. There we go. And one there. And there. And then the, the target's going to go here. And do I have my yellow wool? And the reason I got this yellow wool is because the target will not allow you to place it down on the uh, on, on this on the flower for some odd reason. Very picky like that, you see. Okay, what don't we need that I can get rid of? Um, nothing at the moment. So let's just go right ahead and do this. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get some more lapis, don't I? Dang it! All right, well let's just get the. Um... You got an eye on things. Good job. Okay. <laughs> Let's just get the target in here and see if this is going to work the way I want it to. Just like that. And we're going to have to put this lever right next to it and crank it up. There we go. Beautiful. Now, I think what I want to do next is get some... I'm going to get some fencing, and I might even have some extra fencing over here when I built Camp Cluck. Although I think I grabbed that too for something. So I might have to make some more fencing. Arr oh, wow. <laughs> I made a lot of fencing here because I thought I was going to use more, but I guess I did not. However, it is the wrong style of oh, fence. This is a scary fence. We want a friendly fence. I think this is the friendliest one. Thin iron grids. Yeah. We don't want the denizens, <laughs> the citizens of Flim Flam Street, to see um, barbed wire up here, do we? No, 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 no. We want them to feel safe and happy when they see this. So that they climb up here and they play with it. Um, of course, under supervision. <laughs> Um, how are we going to do this? I might change this up a little bit. Because we're going to have the, uh, the trap door here. Yeah, I'm going to run redstone around the back. And then it's going to activate the uh, the trap door. You'll see. It's going to work out perfectly. Um, I'm going to put up more of this in a minute. But not yet because I want to be able to see in. There we go. Old school style. And we want the water on the second block up from the bottom, not all the way to the top. We want them to fall a little ways and then get splashed, right? So let's do that. One, two. This is going to be fun. The people are going to love us. This is, of course, care of the chimney and uh, Dr. Professor Dumbo Frankensaurs Jr. and Pungent's Alliance. It's not from those bad guys. And we're going to make sure that everyone here in this town knows that it's from us. And I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to settle that water. Not that it matters, but... Um, I'm not really good at settling water. Settle down, water! Settle! Stop! You... See? Whoops. We need to get the redstone over here. So, the victim... We'll stand here and go, ha ha, you can't dunk me. And then you try to shoot the uh, the target, right? 
You've done that. Not with arrows, I hope. <laughs> oh my gosh. But perhaps with um, balls. You know, toss balls or something. So now what we need to do is we need to get this up here. And this is where I'm going to need... Yeah, I'd rather use blue for this than the yellow to keep it all the same color. Let me go get some lapis. I know there's some lapis down there. I just have to go find it. Uh, um, down When I say down there, I mean there is a... Uh, does this have fortune? Fortune 3. There's a hole over here that Pungent's made when it went down here and got that basalt. And I, my guess is there's some lapis down here. I have to go find it. Oh, hi! Can you direct me to the nearest lapis, please? You know what I just realized? What a dummy I am. Yeah, I just realized that now. After all these years, I just realized it. Uh, actually, no. What I realized is, in my single-player testing of this, I used a completely different lapis block. I chiseled it down. I used panel or the dark. I forget now which, but I don't want to use the standard block. I want to switch that up. I'm going to go with the dark. And I think I'm going to I'm gonna break this down and redo it. I already took the water out. So I apologize for that, but let me just do that really quickly. I just want to let you know what's going on here because I want to, uh, because it's going to change. It's going to change before your very eyes. And you'll be like, hey, wasn't that a different color blue? And I don't want you to think you're going crazy. It's not you. You're not going crazy. All right, my minions. I am back, and we are now just about where we left off before I realized my little, uh, my little error, but just a minor speed bump along the way, if you will, and I apologize for that, but check it out. It looks really nice. I like that darker color blue better than the natural lapis. And oh, by the way, my water settled down. I finally got it to stop swirling about and being a nuisance. It just required a, a, a little bit of a, a spanking, that's all. Sometimes you got to get physical with that water, right, Shep? Tough love, tough love, I know. Okay, now we have to carry a redstone signal to our trap door, and that's going to be from over here. And, and I did change this, uh, the giant yellow flower out because I want to, I kind of want to preserve that. Um, and I moved this over one too because this will, this signal will be, uh, will be sent adjacent to that block there. You don't have to come out the backside. I'm pretty sure about that. We'll test that theory in a moment. But all right, now we want to get up here and. We're going to have to get the redstone to go up and then turn. And I'm just, just not my, my thing here, but I'm pretty sure if we use these funky doohickeys, the redstone repeaters, we can make this work. So that's going to go into the backside here, and that's going to power up that block, which will send the signal to the, to the trap door. Um, and then we've got to carry this up, and yeah, as long as that's attached, that looks good. And we are going to need... We're going to put this here... Um, depending on how far you shoot this target from, it, uh, it sometimes will not send a signal, a powerful enough signal to reach over here. I have tested that. So I put a repeater here, which is going to repeat the signal a little bit more, make it, uh, make it more, I guess, more powerful. But, you know, we'll test that later. I'm pretty sure that's going to work. Why don't, you know, let's just test this right now, just to make sure that we can at least get a signal in. It's going to drop that. Yep, perfect, just the way we like it. And that's just long enough for someone to be dunked in. I know it's quitty, it's it's quitty, it's pretty quick, and I'm sure there's a way to delay it. Um, I don't think we have to go down that road. I'd rather not. But uh, we'll give it a test. We'll get somebody over here to test it out sooner or later. Okay, we are, we're not done yet. We're not done yet. We still have the stairs to put on this side over here. And the way we're going to do this is, where's my diamond thingy? Here it is. What we're going to do now is get some of these slabs for this. Thank you. 
we're getting there, folks, but we are not done yet. Igor, look at him eyeing that guy. He's like, hey, boss, boss, all it would take was a little shove with my little piggy hand. What do you think, boss? Or just a little shove, he won't even know what hit him. <laughs> hey, hey, Igor, <clears throat> whatever you feel is necessary, you just go with it, okay? Use your, your gut instinct, whatever it happens to be. No questions asked. I won't punish him. All right. Um, now, now what I want to do is something pretty fantastic. And you will be amazed. Um, maybe. And here's what I want to do. So these guys, I think I want to make, uh, I want to make um, blah, 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 strips. So if I do... I like that. I do. I like that. And that fits in perfectly. Very cool. And now we're not done yet. Let's go put some nubbins away. And we're going to make, uh, we're going to make, what are we going to make with these guys? We're going to make posts. So we want like, let's grab 10 of those. Yes! That's the look I'm looking for. That's the look I'm looking for. Um, dang it, it's night. I'm going to go sleep. I'll be right back. Here's where we get real silly. So let's put some stuff away here. Bing, 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 bing. And I want to grab something here that ought to let the cat out of the bag. We've got a statue hammer. Hello! Everybody wants a piece of me. Um, hold on. Okay. Nobody important, just a telemarketer. Stop calling, you stinking bums. Okay, that's why we needed to put that right on that edge so we could put a block here. And now, where's my sand? Here's my sand, so check this out. So we never really named this place, but I'm gonna sh I'm gonna give it a name right now. Um, but I am gonna have to find some bananas. Oh wait, you know what? I wanted to raise this up too one more time. Hold on. Put this up here. Raise up the fence. And if you look at the pictures, like I said, the real ones in real life on Google, they have these fences here so that the people sitting here are protected from getting smacked in the face with baseballs or softballs or whatever else they're getting thrown at at the target. I mean, you have to be really bad to miss that target and hit someone sitting here. But this is how lawsuits work. Just ask, uh, ask Pig Girl over there. She's the lawyer in town. Okay, in a society of laws and uh, sue first, ask questions later. We just never can be too cautious. Okay, hi, Sand. Bam. Now, I'm going to put a name in here. This is an old... <laughs> this is an old account that I've not used in a long time. But check him out. It's a monkey. It is a monkey. Oh, no, 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 you got to do this. Now, check this out. We are going to make a little monkey here. This is going to be... His name is Bananas. And this was going to be... Um, Royal Banana... Uh, I don't know, Chimp or something. Ban banana... Go Bananas Dunk Tank. Yeah, that's the one. 
Now, how about a face? Okay, he's looking down, so we want him sitting. He's kind of sitting on the top. That's what it's going to look like. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh, the higher you raise his legs, the more sittery he looks. And he's going to be looking down like this. And then he should be, whoops, pointing down. I want him pointing down at the, uh, uh, at the target. Okay, let's sculpt that one. Check it out. <laughs> hey, wait, I'm not done yet. Wait till you see what this monkey's wearing. It's not just this regular old monkey. It's a monkey in a bikini. <laughs> Go ape. Yeah, we got to come up with a name for this place. I haven't found anything clever yet. I haven't thought of anything clever, but I will. So he's like sitting up there like, hey, dude, look, see that down there? You got to shoot the target. Get, get it, can you? And we put a little guy over here, too. He's sitting here on the corner. Okay. I've got one more monkey over here pointing toward the stairs. Saying, right this way. Step right up. Get all wet. Go, ape. Go, bananas. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> I'm just putting the final touches on here. So let's just do one last thing to really rub it in. Whoops, missed. Figuratively and, well, yeah, literally. Rub it in. I love it. So much for you and your soldiers and your guns. Check it out. The Go Ape Dunk Tank is in town. <laughs> so I put a, a piece of paper in his hand. It looks like a towel, right? I went over to the tiki place over here and got a, a star shell. And I put a bow in that guy's hand, and in this ape's hand, he's got an arrow, like he's pulling him out of the, out of the, uh, the target, right? So then over here we have the sign, and it says, "Go ape dunk tank, good citizens of Flim Flam Street, enjoy this dunk tank, kindly provided by PSJ Chimpong Alliance." And I, I'm pretty sure Gliss is going to join us too, but I'm not positive about that. I don't want to give him false credit, so I need to find out if that's true or not. And finally, let's give it a test. Ooh. Yeah, I heard it. Go bing! Very cool. So, I suppose we can stand back here and shoot, right? How about if I go get one little yellow flower? A piece of yellow flower. Uh, actually, let's put the plate. This would be like where you stand. I'll put a sign over here, right? On top of... Uh, how about if we put it right here? Yeah, stand here. Okay, guys, I'm still here. I just wanted to show you that I did indeed provide a bow and some arrows and a sign with instructions uh, and the seat, of course, and a, uh, a Go Ape Dunk Tank employee pointing, hey, have a seat, here's your bow, and fire away. Well, you know what? Let's give him an arrow, too. How about that? Perfect. I love it. I love it. So fun. Anyway, all right, guys and gals, now we are indeed done here. I hope you enjoyed, and we'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.